and I'm back. I told you I would be back, and now I am. Now, if you did not watch my last video, you have no idea what I'm talking about. So, this is going to be a nail polish haul. It is Zoya. So, I don't know if you can see. It says, Art of Beauty is Zoya Cutica Smart Spa Nocti and Zoom Dry. So, I bought Zoya. Um, they had a special on free nail polish. Three free. So, you just had to pay shipping, which was actually $15. But um, I think uh, with all the nail polishes I got, I think it was like $28. I got two $9 ones and a $10 one. So it was $28 and I got them for free with $15 shipping. Um, this is the first time I've ever bought Zoya. I did get, I do have one Zoya. That's all I have. One Zoya. And I got it in a subscription box that I have not yet got. I should be getting it um, this month. It should be shipping out soon. Um, it's called Fab Fit Fun, so it is a seasonal box, so it comes four times a year, and I think it was last spring I got one nail polish from Zoya, and that is my only one I have, so I thought I would buy them because why not? So in this bag, which I just opened the bag. It has the Naked Manicure, which I actually just got a um, an email about. And so it's supposed to help your fingernails. And since mine, you know, are a little bit, like, cracked. Not cracked, but, like, they're white from the glue and ripping them off. I actually am thinking about buying this. I was going to do a little bit more research. But it's supposed to um, be better for your nails. So here we go. So this is damage before and then damage after. So it has, so see like that's more like how mine is and that's supposed to what it's fixed. Like I said, I'm going to do, a, these are yellow and then fixed. So I'm going to do a little bit more research before I get it. But these do actually look interesting to me because this is what my problem is from all of the um, glue and just ripping them off with acrylics so it says gel damage right there so I'm actually considering this because this is literally how my nails are naked and that's how it's supposed to fix it so that would be a good something to do on YouTube is see if it really works you know I would like to do that and they are different colors so I'm really considering this I'm considering it so we will get into that later let me I'll let you know if I did it oh by the way I did get a full 124 125 49 refund on my credit card from the failed jewel of Hall. so it is completed I just got a survey for my um, input, which I did not do yet. So I did get a full refund of the shipping it back and all of the polishes that I ordered like I did. So I actually chose because I only have the one Zoya polish. It's like a pinkish color, no, nothing like fancy. So this time I actually went through and I ordered one of each of their like collection. Like they have, you know, the satins and the pixie dust or something. So I went through and I got one color. I got, you know, three. So I got three different what do you call those? Collections, I guess. So I guess they're all three in this box. Like I said, I've never ordered from Julep, so I don't know. We'll see. Zoya, why don't you sing Julep? Just so you guys know, I actually, this is the second time I'm filming this. I deleted the other one because I said I got a huge Julep haul. And it's not Julep, it's Zoya. So, starting with this one. There are three in here. So, as I said, I got one, I got three completely different kinds. So this is Zoya Satin. 
and it is in the color Tove. Okay, Tove satin. So that is what I got. I'm sorry if it's not focusing. I mean, it's it just says Zoya satin. I'm pretty sure you can read it. So it is a gray because what did I just say in my last like list email? that I don't really have grays and I do not do nudes so I got a light gray and the satins I think they're supposed to be like between matte and shiny I think like I said I don't have any so but I'm pretty sure I saw a review and they're supposed to be not shiny but not matte right in the middle so and the bottle I mean the bottle feels nice and it looks like matte that I don't know if you can tell. But it looks like matte or something. So I'm excited to try this one eventually. For the next one. So see the difference in the bottles? Just in the bottles. See how this one is like more milky looking? This one is completely clear. So this one is Pixie Dust. This is the Zoya Pixie Dust. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's hard to read through the glitter. I don't know, but it's Zoya Pixie Dust in the color Nori. And blue is my favorite color, so of course I got the blue sparkly one. Now all of the big glitters are on this side, so it must have been laying like that in the box. This one is more clear, not clear, but it doesn't have all the big chunks. So this is the Pixie Dust line there, maybe it's the line. So the satin line, I got one from the satin line, and now I have one from the Pixie Dust line. And it is Nori, that I sure is not going to work. Yeah, we're just not even going to try. So I'm excited to try this one too because and the blue. And our last one. Ooh. Maybe this was matte. Yes. So this is Loridana. I really did not look at the names. I looked at the colors when I was ordering it. Loridana matte. So this bottle. Um, to me, they look exactly the same. So this is the satin bottle, and this is the matte bottle, and they look the same, which is completely different from the clear bottle. And I'm pretty sure the one that I have came in a pretty clear bottle like this. So, I have never actually purchased a complete collection. Like, I watch all these videos online of collections. Sorry, I just hit the tripod all these collections I have never ever ever bought a collection of nail polish I just get random polishes so this is matte I believe it says slash M-A-T so I'm pretty sure matte is M-A-T-T-E but they shortened it I guess I wish my camera would focus can you see it I'm so sorry, but it's Lordana Matte, and so it is a gray, like, shimmery looking one, or maybe it's a dark blue, I don't know, I'm not sure, but so that is my Zoya haul, like I said, it was free, I don't know if you can see this paper, everything was free with $15, so... $15 shipping. But like I said, it was $8, 8 and $9, uh, 9, 9 and $10. So I saved a little bit of money. <clears throat> so that is my Zoya haul. Um, real quick, I can, since, I mean, this is nail polish, I'm going to just do like a nail polish haul. I can open my Listia mail, which is also a nail polish. That way I can only upload two videos today. Oh, <laughs> 
illuminating. It's not working either. Goodness. Oh, got it. <laughs> Hold on, real quick, I gotta go to see what I paid for this because I don't know. But it is Zoya by OPI Nail Color and it's totally karma. A nice little green there. <sighs> so I have a few Zoya by OPI. I mean Sephora. Oh my goodness. Sephora by OPI. I have one or two that I got off Lithia. I've never bought this. I don't even know where to buy this. I mean I'm assume Sephora, but um I don't know for sure. I paid the equivalent of three to four dollars for this. Um, I I think I Google them before I buy it, and I think it was like eight to nine dollars. You can get it somewhere online, like eBay or something. So that is a green, like a kind of like a puke green, actually. Um, I don't know if they did a color description. I don't think so. But that is what I got today in my mail, my nail polish haul, and then my treats haul. So, if there's anything you guys are um, wanting me to subscribe to, please let me know. Um, there's so many out there, I couldn't even, like, if I tried, I could not even get them all. So, I need you guys' hints or um, information, any boxes, subscription boxes, or hauls that... Like, I got an email saying that there were three free with $15 shipping. That's just an email. I mean, if I didn't get the email, I would never have known if I wasn't subscribed to Zoya email. So, if you guys know of anything, let me know and I can order it for you guys to see. Just let me know. So, thank you for watching and please subscribe and I will see you guys later. Bye.